Simone and Simone in the red. All right, this is a big deal, guys. They could put anybody in that they wanted to start this. Lencioni went from his side. John Simone came from the opposite side. Backstory, Lencioni and the Simones were teammates and training partners every single day for years. Lencioni left the gym, started his own thing. They have now meeting for the first time. Former partners, former teammates. And now it's Lencioni on bottom with John Simone on top. And I know what Lencioni is thinking. He's thinking, John, bring me Ricky. Lencioni is saying something. Good little reversal there. Lencioni wants to stay in here. You never know what happened when somebody leaves a gym, in all fairness. And I belong to this same gym. I don't know what happened. And a lot of guy, times, guys leave very politely. And they say all of the right things. And right here, Papworth comes in from behind. That was good work. Papworth coming right into the back. Lencioni has three seconds to be out, guys. There is a rope in the corner. The rope extends 12 inches. You must hold that rope at all times or you would be in violation and there is a remedy for that, including disqualification. At the time a tag happens, the man who is coming out must have his hand on the rope, but he has three seconds. Another interpretation is I have three seconds with my partner to double team, to manipulate. Sunshine is coaching his partner, Papsworth, and I think that that is irritating to Ricky Simone because I hear Ricky speaking up from the other corner. Should we get into an overtime scenario, it will be much like what you guys just saw to start this match where each team will send out one guy. I can assure you Sunshine will be the guy, and I can assure you he will be wanting Ricky. John Simone has Papworth pinned up against the fence over here. Papsworth, Papsworth is going to be able to take a little energy out of John. Anytime somebody's got your head, they've got your neck, that's going to be annoying. That's going to cause you a little bit of energy. I do not believe he can get a submission over John from here. And guys, in case you're just tuning in, in tag team, if there is a submission, the match will continue. If you tap, you are out, your partner is automatically in. The match will continue. We will go all eight minutes. We will then tally up which team collectively has more. Ricky Simone wants in and John is just not doing it. John is just not going to tag in his cousin Ricky and I feel that he should. In all fairness, I don't know why John would want to stay in this position. Not to mention, you now have this. John's got to have his hand on the rope in less than three seconds. Papsworth is the one holding him, though. John Simone could not get out. It was Papsworth holding John Simone there. Yeah, Ricky is elbowing him. I hear Sunshine yelling, he's elbowing him, man. Yeah, yes, Ricky's getting aggressive. Sunshine, y'all goaded him for the last four minutes in front of the world. You're going to have to say, yeah, he's coming in hot. That's true. All right, there was a tag there. Nope, got to let him go. Doesn't have it in three seconds. Ricky has got to be out. He's got to get a hold of the 12-inch rope. Now, see, this is one of the reasons that the Simones are so respected. Look at this. This is a mauling. This is a mauling done by strategy. Of course you would want to bring your opponent. Of course you would want to bring your opponent to your side. Referee informed John that he must have a hold of that rope. I can assure you, you will not get a second warning. To go back about the strategy of what's happening right here, this is a mauling. The cousins have brought him to their corner. They plan to rotate this position repeatedly. 
and Papsworth is going to be stuck. The only difference is he's going to be more and more fatigued each time. There are no submissions thus far, which I think is surprising. Papsworth, who's not done this before and is pinned in the corner of the Simones and being rotated on, has not had a joint manipulated yet. We also have not seen Sunshine, who's on the other side of the cage. And I, look, he, Sunshine's just not coming back into this unless the Simones do something wrong. This mauling is going to continue for the rest of regulation. Eventually, in all likelihood, Sunshine and Ricky are going to touch tonight. But it might have to be overtime. John gets out a little quicker. But the mauling continues. Notice where Papsworth is, and I keep pointing this out because so many people want to come and do tag team. This is how tag team is done right. This is exactly how tag team is done right, and Papsworth needs to get hip to this quickly. Papsworth is doing a very good job of protecting himself from tapping. This is the first real threat that is likely to result in submission. But when you got a couple of hyenas taking down a wildebeest and they keep him in the corner, this is how tag team is done right. And Papsworth needs to figure this out that, hey, this isn't just about me not tapping. I have got to get to the opposite corner. Papsworth is going to have to get free and run. Now, that, see, that's good work right there. That was excellent work. Excellent work by the Simones. Papsworth is trapped. Hey, Papsworth's fighting his ass off, guys. Passworth is getting mauled. He's got the number six ranked uh, uh, UFC fighter in the world on his back. Come up right now, come up right now. Looks like John wants to come in. I'm not sure why, John. I think Ricky's about to, oh, John, you tapped, you tapped. No, Ricky's got to let go. John, you tapped him in right as he was about to get a finish. But you're now seeing where this is a problem, right, guys? I mean, put anybody in Pap's worst spot. Anybody you want. I'll listen. Leandro Lowe, go ahead. Keenan Cornelius, go ahead. Gordon Ryan, go ahead. You tell me anybody that you know that is good enough to be able to, to, to flip the scale on this molly. There are no submissions at this point. At this point, if there are no submissions and 50, sex, 50 seconds elapses, we will go into overtime, which is the only feasible scenario where you will see Ricky and Sunshine going at it. If there is a tap in the next 30 seconds, that will be a one point lead for the American top team. 20 seconds. If there is no submission, we do go to overtime, which is where you're going to see the emergence of sunshine. 10 seconds. 10 seconds. They're going to try to tap him. They've got five seconds to do it. I mean, Papsworth, not for nothing. I mean, <laughs> Papsworth, come on, guys. Can we please hear it for Papsworth? Can we please hear it for what Papsworth just did? Sunshine, I hear him. He's accused the other team of cheating. That, that, that is not accurate. That was not called by the referee. This is just this is just talk going on. All right, who's going in? Is it going to be John or is it going to be Ricky? This is going to be very interesting. John is going to go in. All right, well, that being said, take one. You guys get to decide. Are you? That's what I said. You called it. Are you decided? Former so, teammates. Chris, Sunshine Williams. will decide the position as he takes former teammate John Simone in the first exchange of overtime. How in the world, Papworth? survived the single biggest mauling I've ever I've ever witnessed <laughs> I mean Ryan right right I'm not exaggerating I've never seen a mauling like that in a grappling match that was the rules being used to the absolute fullest 
All right, round and round we go. I know Sunshine wanted to be in there with Ricky. He is in there with cousin John Simone. I'm laying out so you guys can hear the discussion. Dave Hagen being very calm, being very responsible while trying to herd four fighters in a steel cage at the same time. John could come out of this. John's trying to come all the way over. You notice Chris is trying to stop him. Now Chris's hips are down. This is the same position Checo just had success in. John is very tight here. You're seeing a lot of fingers and hands by John Simone. However, the more fingers you see, the better he is. That, that, that he's using that grip not to attack, but to defend. Sunshine is trying to pull down on this, and John is crowding down with that weight. All right, Sunshine just told somebody, I will break your effing elbow. And I'm telling you guys that because I think he might have been talking to Ricky. I do not know the extent of the bad blood. Fabiano Scherner is my coach. I have asked him. He has never told me anything. Fabiano Scherner has never said one thing about Sunshine except positive things. I have asked Sunshine about Coach Fabiano. He has never said one bad word. So then again, when you're dealing with a 300-pound Fabiano, that's, that could just be good health right there. <laughs> but I, in all fairness, I've never heard that there was ever any bad blood. But here we are. Facebook can be deceiving. Instagram can be deceiving. UFC Fight Pass on a Sunday under the unified rules is not deceiving. John's coming underneath. I don't think John's going to be able to finish Sunshine as long as that arm of Sunshine's is involved. That arm is now gone, but Sunshine's starting to get down. There is a, a game being played here with the clock. Sunshine does not have time to waste. He is going to have to move. John Simone is so determined. You know, what John S Simone's trying to do, he's trying to get Sean Shelby and Mick Maynard's attention. What John wants to do is just get on Dana White Contender Series. He's an MMA guy himself. He's a training partner and a big advocate of Cousin Ricky, who's ranked number six. But John would also like his opportunity. I bring that to you because a lot of you might be saying, well, how come Ricky didn't jump in there? Well, Ricky's really not even here tonight for himself. Ricky's here tonight to get a spotlight on his cousin, so he sent his cousin in with Sunshine. We had A.J. Agazarm called out earlier tonight. Sunshine's last MMA win was in Bellator over A.J. Agazarm. Agazarm, of course, a, a silver medal in Abu Dhabi. I bring that to you and tell you a good AJ is so that you understand Sunshine beat him. Somebody sign this guy. More sign than you, buddy. More sign than you. What's going on, man? You're losing. I got multiple real estate holdings. You're losing. Two gyms. Enough. What do you got, brother? What do you got, baby? What do you got, baby? You got nothing. Yes, I can, I can hear everything they're saying, guys. I, I laid out there. I wanted you guys to hear it. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed about what we just heard. I'm embarrassed that that is what's happening. At the same time, I thought you, the audience, was owed the right to hear. I believe I'm going to continue to do that, for better or worse. But I am going to disclose for you why I'm letting you. I don't know what's going to be said. It's only once I hear it that I get embarrassed. They were talking about... Real estate, hold it for goodness sakes. Are you both ready? Yes, sir. Let's go forward one more. Go forward one more. It's very oh. personal, guys. People tell you sports shouldn't be personal. It is personal. It is personal. They used to be teammates. <laughs> Ricky signed to the UFC. Sunshine signed to Bellator. John Simone looking to get the attention and get an opportunity on the Contender Series. It is personal. Ryan, I am going to sit back. I'm going to let this play out. Ah! 
Sunshine going to 37 seconds on that. I don't, I don't know all of the times, guys. I was distracted by the real estate holdings talk. <laughs> okay. John's on the back, though. Time favors Team Simone. I do not know by how much, but Team Simone is gaining time right now. Sunshine is going to have to get out. John Simone with the body triangle. Sunshine's problem here, he's got to turn in, right? You guys can see that. If he turns in too aggressively, he turns in to an arm triangle. Is this the bottom, the top of the third? Top of the third. Top of the third. You each have one more to go. Yeah. Watch your back, sir. Third, sir. Top of the third, they will okay, both okay. be given one more chance to go. Sunshine's got the back. John Simone is protecting, but Sunshine has a body triangle. Sunshine is going to gain time here. If he gains a submission, we, we could have a very different outcome than the one that we're headed for, and Sunshine knows it. Sunshine's got the back of John Simone tight. John has his chin down. The reason you see John's mouthpiece right there, that's good news for, that's good news for John. That means his chin is down. You'll notice Sunshine has a body triangle. In a perfect world, he would have it on the other side. This choke is getting tighter. Sunshine's choke is getting yeah. tighter. He got him. He got him, but John will have one more try himself. John will be given one more chance. John will be given one more chance. He must finish in submission, guys, and he will have 39 seconds to do it. If he does not submit him prior to 39 seconds, this match is over. Sunshine will have, and Papsworth. I'm ignoring Pap, Pap, Papsworth, the star of the night. Took a mauling, and he's still around to talk about it. Sunshine and Ricky Simone will not settle their business tonight. Sunshine does not have to worry about the hips here. All he has to do is worry about the neck. The only thing that can cost him this match is if he submits. I believe that he's free. The referee is looking at this and saying that's still a catch. He's going to have to clear his own arm or his head. Yes, the referee is looking at this as a catch, and the referee's right. If John Simone can jump his body all to the right side, he's trying to clear it right now. If he gets to the right side, he will submit. But he did not. Not within time. Papworth. Papworth, who sustained a two-on-one mauling. Got to the overtime. The Simones have been defeated. Ricky and Sunshine. Unfinished business. Everything Kevin Keeney. Ladies and gentlemen, your winners due to a rear naked choke at 39 seconds in the top half of overtime round number three. And new Submission Underground Tag Team Champions of the World, Team SAC. Chris Lincioni and Owen Papworth. Sure. Let me know when the Mason when it's ready. Okay. 